Prince Harry's behavior has changed in the last year, a royal expert said as she warned it would be a tragedy if the bond between the Duke of Sussex and Prince William broke after years of brotherly love. Prince Harry's relationship with Prince Willem has clearly soured, according to royal author Penny Junner. The royal expert noticed how things have soured with Prince Harry, who looks very different from the young royal the country has grown to know and love in the past years. She told the Daily Mail, as his biographer, I know there is great affection and admiration for Harry, not just in this country but around the world. He has represented the Queen on many occasions now and been a fantastic ambassador for the British monarchy. He is charming, funny, and modest, he has genuine compassion and a very real desire to use his position to help others, and in things like founding Sente Vale, walking with wounded veterans to the South Pole, and launching the Invitus Games, he has done exactly that. But things have soured in the last year and many of us feel this is not the behavior of the Harry we know and love the Harry who wanted to be treated like just one of the blokes. Ever since Meghan Markle joined the royal family, there has been this constant buzzing that there is a growing rift between Prince Harry and Prince William. Though much of the rumors have focused on Markle and Kate Middleton, there has been a growing interest in the relationship between the two brothers. Recent moves by the family have only fueled the rumors. And while many people may have dismissed the rumors as just that, rumors, a recent Vanity Fair article brings the relationship between the two brothers back into the spotlight. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry began dating in 2016. Prince Harry and Markle met through a mutual acquaintance three years ago. The two quickly connected and began dating shortly after their initial meeting. It wasn't long before the paparazzi started talking about the couple's relationship. The royal family is no stranger to paparazzi obsessing over the relationships of their young princes. Prince William married Middleton in 2011 after dating his former classmate for nearly a decade. Perhaps it was Prince William's difficult relationship the media or his long relationship with Middleton that caused the eldest prince to caution his brother about moving too quickly with his new love. Ms. Junner highlighted A-listers have been defending Prince Harry and his wife, Meghan Markle, in the past weeks, after the couple was hit by harsh criticism for flying with private jets four times in 11 days for private trips. This is one of the aspects marking a clear division between today's Harry and the bloke of the past, Ms. Junner said. She said, following news of the private jet jaunts to Ibiza and Elton John's home in the south of France, Harry and Meghan have kept silent, but a posse of high-profile celebrities have taken to social media to defend the couple. Sir Elton said he had provided the jet to Nice so the family could have a private holiday inside the safety and tranquility of his home there. And the jet was to maintain a high level of much-needed protection, citing Diana's untimely death and claiming press intrusion contributed to it. And as Prince Harry looks distant from the public, Ms. Junner, said, his relationship with his brother William also seems in danger. She said, how desperately sad it is to see these two families, the Cambridges and the Sussexes, pitted against one another. Even allowing for some media hype, there is clearly something awry with the once Fab Four. This week, the Royal Foundation, set up by William and Harry in 2009 to oversee their joint charitable projects, was formally disbanded when the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and the Duke and Duchess of Sussex formally sent notice to Companies House that their joint name should be struck from its official register. The Sussexes are establishing their own foundation. William and Harry were once so close, friends, allies, brothers, always teasing, so obviously happy in each other's company. Kate seemed to fit into the relationship seamlessly. They had each other's backs and there was every expectation they always would have. It would be nothing short of a tragedy if that bond between Diana's boys was to fall apart permanently and something the public would hate to see. Rumors of a feud between the Cambridges and the Sussexes sparked in November last year, when Kensington Palace announced Meghan and Harry were moving out of Nottingham Cottage on the grounds of Kensington Palace to relocate in Windsor. In February, Speculation regarding a formal division between the families were confirmed after Meghan and Harry were granted the right by the Queen to create their own household. The relationship between Princes Harry and William has been under stress for a while. 
the public has speculated that there has been an ongoing feud between Middleton and Markle that has caused ongoing strain the two royal couples. However, according to Vanity Fair, it appears that the issues may stem from the brothers and not their wives. According to a recent article, Prince Harry did not take too fondly to his brother's comments to slow things down with Markle. A source told the magazine that Prince William thought that Prince Harry and Markle got engaged too soon, noting, William had concerns and Harry resented that. Harry also felt that William and Kate hadn't made enough effort with Meghan. Things were reportedly pretty bad between the brothers, with the source adding that there was a point that the Duke of Cambridge and the Duke of Sussex did not speak to each other. However, after the birth of Markle and Prince Harry's first child, it appears that things have improved. Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton were recently seen out together. Markle and Middleton took a break from their royal duties and family obligations and attended Wimbledon this year. The match featured a face-off between Markle's longtime friend, Serena Williams, and Romanian tennis player Simona Halep. This marked the second year in a row that the two attended Wimbledon together. Last year, Markle and Middleton attended the event shortly after Markle and Prince Harry's wedding. This year, the two were joined by Middleton's sister, Pippa. The three women were all smiles as they watched the event, almost squashing memories of rumored feuding. Is the royal feud between Prince William and Prince Harry over? Prince Harry and Prince William have never remarked on the status of their relationship. Like most siblings, they are going to have their ups and downs. The Vanity Fair source notes that not only have things got a lot better since Archie was born, but the splitting of the households has also made things easier for the two families. Prince Harry and Markle have always demanded a higher level of privacy than Prince William and Middleton. They are able to do this as they do not have the same demands placed on them as the future king and queen consort. This struggle to find balance, respect boundaries, and understand one another has likely led to misunderstandings and hurt feelings. For now, it appears that everyone is starting to find their place and the two families may be able to finally find some peace.